Chris McDougall, world-renowned author and New York Times columnist, visited Kutztown on September 20th. He first met with KU freshmen to discuss his book, Born to Run, the freshman text this year. You know, the one thing every student should take away from Born to Run or anything else discussing exercise is think back to when they're five years old. The number one joy in their life was recess. The number one place they wanted to be was outside. And the one, number one thing they wanted to feel was this suspension of gravity. I mean, people love to feel like they're floating in the air. Swing sets, trampolines, water slides, sliding boards. That's what running can be. It's suspending yourself from gravity one step at a time. You get that sensation, and how can it not put a smile on your face? McDougall wondered why the Taramara could run long distances without getting the routine injuries like most American runners. He finds that most of the injuries are caused by the modern cushioned running shoes. The Taramara used thin sandals for running. Yeah, you know, the one thing I think everybody can learn from the Taramara is that running does not have to be a punishment for pizza. It doesn't have to be the thing you do in order to do something else. Most of us run only because we want to get into shape for something else or to make up for what we ate the night before. But the one thing that is really emblematic of the Tarahumara is that running is its own form of play. It's its own pleasure. And if you can bring that back, particularly to college students who are dealing with stress and tight schedules all the time, if they can carve out 20 minutes where it's just recess and they come back with a smile on their faces, that they've won.